yeah, right here out of my uh, my hotel room, I can see the mighty Mississippi River, and it's flowing right to left. So I've got my stuff with me, my my carp tackle, and I'm gonna head over to that side. Maybe I've seen a spot over there which looks pretty good, uh, just where a um, a small stream comes out of the out of the bank there. So I'm gonna go over there and. Uh, yeah, uh, on the question of bait, you are back in my hotel room. The guitar, practicing this morning, good boy. Um, on the question of bait for carp, what I use it as a, uh, when I can't get anything else for, for a method mix is this stuff. You just dampen it down and you can mold it around a uh, method feeder, mix it up with a bit of sweet corn, even put some cream corn in it, and it makes a really good sticky method mix. This is the uh, spot I'm fishing. Uh, you have the river coming down, flowing down this way. I'm standing on an island and the river coming back down the other way, uh, same way around this island and it meets here, sort of a confluence here. And this is where I was gonna fish, but uh, because it looks really good on the surface, but in actual fact, it's only about a foot deep, or uh, too shallow to fish. Um, so I'm fishing around here. Um, there's a much better depth of water. Probably drops off to about, God, I don't know, 15 feet. That's not a dead body, by the way. It's just a bit of rubbish. I'm gonna pick it up in a minute. Um, I'm, I'm having uh, bites close in, about a rod length out. Um, Looks a bit dodgy if I get one, I'll have to climb down those rocks, but it's interesting, I'm really enjoying it. Bit of a challenge, I've never fished here before. Well, I kept getting these bites and losing these fish felt quite heavy. This, 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 this is what's doing it. I think this is a, a sort of a buffalo car or something. I'm not even sure what it is. So it's about five hours, so I'm going to put it back. Change of swims, got out the wind, and I'm in a, a sort of a bit of an eddy off the main current. And uh, I've only been here about five minutes, and I had this one. Only a little fella, but nice fish, nearly caught a bloody rod in. But it's uh, a Mississippi carp. It'll probably get a bit bigger than that. I'm hoping. Let's see.
13 pound mark as well. Well, here's my setup today. It's just crammed a load of corn on a size uh, 10 quarter crank, 10 pound sink braid by Drennan, and a method feeder. And I'm just going to use this concoction here, which I showed you earlier. This is the uh, Quaker Oats there. Here you go, here he is. And all you do is mold it around the feeder. It's quite nice and milky, look. See all that attraction coming out of it. It binds really well around the feeder. Like that. Probably do a bit, bit tighter, but. Lost a couple, messing about trying to fill the run, but that's a better one. Just under 13 pound. Uh, on the sweet corn, classic sweet corn, and that's a really good fire. 